The Padres taking on the Giants. Odrisimer de Spagne on the hill for San Diego. Top of the first, Pablo Sandoval at the plate with two outs and a man on. And as he tries to check his swing, he gets hit in the elbow by the pitch. During the half inning, just too much pain for Sandoval. He'd be replaced by Joaquin Arias. Top of the second, still scoreless, two outs in the inning. Gregor Blanco steps to the plate and launches one to right center field, a solo shot. The Giants take a 1-0 lead on Blanco's first homer of the year. Bottom of the sixth, still 1-0, runners at the corners, one out. Tim Hudson going for the Giants. Seth Smith with the fly ball to center. Blanco makes the catch and fires home, but the throw is cut off. Brooks Conrad scores easily, and the game is tied at one. Top of the seventh, same score, runners at second and third, nobody out. Kevin Quackenbush now pitching for the Giants. Joe Panic flies one to deep center. Blanco tags and scores from third, and San Francisco has a 2-1 to one lead. Bottom half of the inning, the Padres answer back. One out, a runner at second, Jake Gobert at the plate, and he belts one in the right center off Gene Machi. It's a triple. Yasmani Grandal scores, and the game is knotted at two. Gobert would go on to score on a sacrifice fly, and the Padres take a 3-2 lead to the top of the ninth. Houston Street on to close it out, but Michael Morse leading off the inning. There's a swing. There's a long drive to left field. Way, way back, upper deck. And this game is tied. A hanging slider right out over the middle, and Michael Morris hits his first home run in exactly one month. And that was a loud one. KNBR on the call. Houston Street's first blown save since September 29th of 2013. Bottom of the ninth, the Padres threatening. A man at second with no outs. Grandal at the plate facing Sergio Romo, but Brandon Crawford with a nice play for the first out of the inning may have saved the run from scoring. Later in the inning, runners on second and third, two outs. Romo gets out of the jam by striking out pinch hitter Carlos Quentin to end the inning. We go to extra, still tied at three in the top of the 10th. No outs and a man on. Brandon Belt at the plate facing Dale Thayer. He gets the sign and he sets and the pitch. And a swing and a high drive to right. Venable back. It is out of here. Welcome back, Brandon Belt. The Giants take the lead. And now we get to hear the Giants fans. KNBR once again on the call. The two-run shot gives the Giants a 5-3 lead. They go on to win it by that final. Belt's first home run since May 7th is the difference. The Giants snap a three-game skid. Hunter Pence extends his hitting streak to 10 games in the victory, going two for four with a double. Tim Hudson gets a no decision after allowing just three hits over six innings of one-run ball.